In this example, I'm going to show you how to use the Apply Styles window. First, open default.aspx design view. Go ahead and select your H1 header. Go to Format, New Style. I'm going to do an inline style. And then go ahead and click Box. We're going to set the padding to 0 and margin bottom. We're going to set to 10. This will make it format properly in all browser versions. And apply it. Notice the border or the margin. Next, we're going to go ahead and create a paragraph tag. Modify the style for the paragraph tag. And we're going to create a new style. We're going to call it Introduction. Go ahead and change the font style to italic. Apply now. Our new style makes it active. For the paragraph tag, notice the italics. And see the, the definition of introduction. This is the inline style for our heading. Go back to design, and we're going to view a CSS window. Go to view, CSS properties. You see there's a tremendous number of properties to choose from. And this is the properties for introduction as the one I currently have selected. And you notice at the very top it's set to italic. We're going to go ahead and change the color as well. I'm going to choose an additional color. Actually use a picker to actually pick the color of the hyperlink on our default .aspx page. Go ahead and save it all. Let's go and look at source. And you can see that it added the color to my definition for introduction. Go ahead and run it, and you'll see the changes applied to your default.aspx page.